Welcome back to my channel Design Mention. Today we are going to discuss about the transformation feature toolbar. So in that feature toolbar the the next feature is pattern and scaling and affinity. So in the pattern there are three types of uh, pattern. So first is rectangular pattern, second one is circular pattern, third one is user pattern and uh, next so in scale this is a scaling and affinity pattern is basically used for the creating the duplicates of the feature or the parts and uh, it will the feature or parts may be multiple one or more and the affinity in the scaling we can change the dimensions as per the as per our requirement means uh, you have to create the parts 1 as to 2 ratio uh, half ratio that way so we'll discuss one by one then you will get the concept clear so first is a rectangular pattern in the rectangular pattern i have that two inputs first is a pad and second one i this is a hole okay so i use the first feature in the transformation feature toolbar which is a pattern rectangular pattern so click on that so simply i just uh, see the dialog box here and this is the parameter first direction and second direction the first direction means uh, you have just select the direction here from the reference direction so it uh, you can select the axis or it may be edge also so for example i select this edge of the this part body okay and here object to pattern so this is current object i want to select the object whichever whichever we i wanted to create a duplicate feature by using the pattern so i select this whole okay and preview so i just click on that arrow from the body okay so this is the parameters this is the four types of parameters you can use so first is the instant and length so i select this instant and length so for example i have select the instance i want five instance to create and the length in which for example i select this 100 mm length and i wanted to create five features so it will take the automatic spacing equal center to sentence which is 25 mm distance so i will show now so this is first last feature this is first feature this is the 100 mm dimension uh, length center to center and each pattern length each uh, feature whole length equal distance 25 mm you can see this is 45 25 mm okay so this is the first feature instant and length so second one is the instant and spacing so here you have just input the instant and spacing it will take the length automatically so next one is the spacing and length so in spacing spacing and length you have to give the input instant will take automatically okay so next one is instant and unequal spacing so this is I wanted to create five instant and for example I will select the 50 ml spacing for the first so second one is I wanted to create 30 ml okay fourth one is I wanted to create this feature fourth one is 40 ml fifth one is 30 ml 
preview you can see you can change an equal length and just to input the instant and spacing length an equal length by manually input okay so in second direction you can uh, select the reference direction from the reference element here you can select the edge also or axis here i select the axis you can change the direction from here okay or from here also so instance i want to create uh, three instance in this direction x direction preview and now to do create a spacing 50 mm okay this is how it will perform here the first direction these four commands and in second direction these four parameters are same this is all about the rectangular pattern okay so next feature is our circular pattern for the circular pattern i just create the one pad in the circular direction and second pad is the on that surface so i use this pattern this is the circular pattern so axis reference so i want to, to select the axis rotation this is my axis rotation i want i just wanted to create the is just a minute just wanted to select the reference axis for example i select this z axis i wanted to create this feature by the, by the rotation of this z axis so for example i create the five instance you can see five instance is created you can change the direction from here also or here also okay so here the parameters there are uh, five parameters so first is the instant and total angle so here i just uh, input the instant and total angle for example i take the 90 degree in 90 degree five instants created you can see this is 90 degree okay for example i select the 180 degree It will create equal in length equal in uh, degree so next is a uh, instant and angular spacing so here you want to just uh, input the instant and angular spacing the total angle it will take automatically so next one is a uh, angular spacing and total angle so here you want to do you just wanted to input the angle and total angle angular spacing and total angle okay so next one is a complete ground this is very important so i just wanted to input the instant for example i wanted to create eight instance in this whole, whole 360 degree so angular spacing it will take automatically okay you can see <laughs> so next one is the instant and unequal angular space for example i just wanted to create eight instants and unequal angular spacing for example here i want to create 20 degree okay here I want to create 10 degree. Here I want to create 40 degree. So you can see the difference. This is how you can create the reference duplicate element from the part body.
by using the pattern here the crown definition this is the for example this is the main body this is the main circle so i just wanted to create five and see the result For example, I just complete crow 5 and angular spacing. I just wanted to create it here 100 m. So you can see the result means it will create main body, whole main body, and its pattern. You can generate also multiple duplicate feature or pattern from the crown definitions ok so this is all about the circular pattern so next is the user pattern so for user pattern you can see the input simple pad hole and this is radius okay so i just wanted to create a simple user pattern so for the user pattern you have, i have to create a sketch in that sketch i just uh, give the input of points for example i will input the randomly place a point on that surface okay where i wanted to create the this feature so i just wanted to create user pattern here user pattern definition i just wanted to click on the position current feature i just wanted to create a duplicate of this hole so here you can see the pattern so once again i will show i wanted to create pattern duplicate by by using the pattern is whole and edge fillet so here you can see object object to pattern whole and edge is selected and position i wanted to select these points preview ok you can see the user base pattern is generated this is how you can create the duplicate feature by using the user base pattern this is all about the user pattern so next one is a scaling so in scaling there are two options two feature is there so first is a scale and second is affinity so we'll discuss first one is scale so here you want to just input the reference and ratio so here i just wanted to click point is my reference and ratio i just wanted to create one as to two so here you will get the result For example, I want to create half. This is my one to one. Okay, very simple scaling. Next one is a affinity. So it is this is uh, similar as the scaling, but in affinity you just create the can change the ratio as in the each direction for example x direction y direction and z direction so first i want to select this origin x y plane this is x y plane and x axis this is x axis so i just wanted to create in x axis 1 as to 1.5 you can see 
now it will change the direction its uh, ratio in y axis means this direction i just wanted to create two and z axis in the thickness three you can see the result I, it will be generated this is how you can change change the scale in each axis so this is all about the transformation feature toolbar so finally we will finish the transformation feature toolbar today so in next lecture we will discuss the this reference element